the greenside bunker shot strikes fear into the hearts of a lot of golfers when actually it's not that hard a shot. It's easier to hit than if my ball were sitting in here in the deep rough grass because I can control the spin. When you hit this shot and you hit the sand behind it, you spin the ball. And when the ball is spinning up there, it doesn't roll a lot after it hits. That's controlling it. So consequently, we want to be able to say, hey, that's not so bad. I like this shot. And the reason it's easier is because I know what the sand wedge does. You see, it's built so the leading edge is higher than the trailing edge. The trailing edge is the one you want to hit in the sand because when you do it that way, it does this. It splashes or skips. See that? Just skip through the sand. Skip through. Now, if you have the leading edge down, in other words, you kind of tow this thing in and get your hands way out ahead, which you shouldn't do, and you swing, it doesn't dig, it doesn't splash, it digs like that. You see that digging? Well, that doesn't get any energy to the ball. So consequently, one of the first things we learn is what do we do with the sand wedge to keep it from digging? Well, we set it a little bit open and we set the shaft not forward, but a little bit backward, more vertical. Now I'm going to get a skipper out of it, splasher. And that's the first thing I tell you, teach people to do to hit a sand shot is we stand over here and we take a practice swing and we splash sand out on the green. Yeah, I just splash a little sand out there. I take it back, splash sand out onto the green. Now I'm looking up here, I'm going to do the same thing, but of course it's going to be a longer swing because this is quite a bit farther away. So I'm going to splash sand forward that way and the ball is just going to be splashed out with the rest of it. So it looks something like this. Ball position is forward because you're trying to hit a spot behind the ball. So you don't put it where it normally is, you put it up forward a little bit. You're hitting it intentionally fat. So the shaft now is more vertical than my, my other iron shots and it's going to be a swing from shoulder height to shoulder height. Now that's not going to go 100 yards or 70 yards away over the green. It's just going to hit the sand and splash out of there about this 25 yard shot or so. So this is the way it's going to be done. Set up to the ball, I'm aiming a little left because the face is a little bit open. Swing back and splash sand. There we splash it, give me a good bounce up there. Ah, a little bit short. 